Paul is the best for UK here and welcome to today's Game of Day video. Now today's game is by Crystal Dynamics and it is Total Eclipse. So here's the formation video introduction sequence but let's just skip past this for now and uh, let's get into the game. So this is Total Eclipse, this is not to be confused by Total Eclipse on the 8-bit uh, machines which was by Incentive Software, it's a completely different game, it's got nothing to do with pyramids this one as far as I know. Um, okay, so yep, let's have a look at this one. So we've got controls, music, sound effects, and uh, etc. So let's just play the game. So that's the options here. More FMV sequences, but I'm just going to get straight into the game on this one. I hope you're having a pleasant Monday. Okay, so we've got continue here. Okay, that's some sort of smart bomb. Okay, so this is like a sort of I don't know, almost like a star, a star wing, star fox style game, uh, but on the 3 dr As you can see, it's got really nice textured graphics. Right, okay, we are flying through the uh, cosmos here, well, through uh, over the planet. So you've got these uh, enemy ships here. Oh, you fuck, I just smashed straight into the scenery here. So, yeah, okay, so yeah, graphics very nice, uh, nicely detailed. Uh, you've got a lot of texture map to uh, scenery. Um, which makes it look ten times better than uh, uh, other games of the time. Uh, we've just flat shaded polygons. So yeah, okay, so we proceed on. Watch out for these guys here. Oh, you booner! So I'm not doing too good here. Oh, okay, so yeah, we can shoot these guys. Oh shit! Or we can just go underneath them like that. Uh, okay. Oh yeah, this, the sounds are right as well, nice music and sound effects and stuff. Watch out for, it's quite easy to control. The uh, horizon doesn't like sort of bank, it just always stays straight. So it, when you bank left and right, the horizon still stays straight, so that's um, interesting. I don't think you can change the view on the game, that's just a good poor screen. Uh, whoa, you can, you can do this though, woohee! That is cool. So we can go... We can go like that. Okay. Right. Wee yeah, here we go. Right, yep, yeah. so keep going. The game's quite fun to play actually. It's quite difficult though. Uh, it's quite easy to uh, hit with stuff. Like the scenery and stuff. Let's try and shoot this guy. Ooh. Okay, proceed on. Here we go. Watch out for these guys here. Okay, so do we have to go? Oh, I almost made it as well. Okay, so I think that's like the entrance to level 2 maybe. So let's try and uh, get to it again if we can. Right. Strange looking explosions on the game. I'll destroy them baddies here. Oh, I didn't realise you can hold the fire button down for fast shooting. That's pretty cool. Right, okay. Let's try and get these guys here. Whoa. Here we go. There we go, I've got that one. Okay, proceeding on. Another one here. Have some of this. Right, that's giving me an extra bit of a power up on my arsenal, or weaponry, should I say. So you can collect them if you get them from the middle. Okay, so keep going, proceeding on. Watch out for these guys here. Have some of that. Okay. Right, it looks like we're going down here now. Now, as you can see, it's got... Wow, it looks quite good, actually, the graphics do. Uh, we're going for a tunnel sequence here. Try not to hit the scenery. Yeah, so this definitely reminds me of Star Wing on the SNES, or Super Nintendo. Uh, Star Wing, Star Fox. Star Wing, it was called in the UK. Uh, Star Fox everywhere else, I believe. Whee, so you've got to watch out for the... Uh, the scenery and stuff. Whoa, going fast now. Okay, up, down. Oh shit. Whoa, holy crap. This is really cool actually. What a good game. I'm liking this game very much. I like these space shoot, rail space shooters that, that, that I've always had. This one's not bad actually at all. I mean, the graphics are excellent. Okay, so we are proceeding. Now, to, oh, to round two, so we've done the first bit. So, yeah, it looks pretty technically impressive for the Panasonic 3DO here. It wasn't that bad of a console, to be honest, it had some power to it. Oh, shit. 
a shame it was a bit of a failure uh, because it, it could have had some really decent games. I mean, this game wouldn't knock out a place on the PlayStation 1. So, yeah, okay, so this is a tough, or oh, Eclipse Great, a little uh, rail space shooter, and uh, I'm going to give this one 9 out of 10 because I actually really like it. I think it's really good. Um, and, uh, yeah, so thank you for watching today's video. I'll see you in tomorrow's video. And uh, thank you for watching. Oh, and um, I'm always up for suggestions for Panasonic 3D games if you want to leave any in the comments. I'll try and do. So uh, thank you for watching. Goodbye!